What's up guys? Mr. Bird here again. It's great to have so many of you here back with us in our distance learning virtual history classroom. I apologize for any technical problems the other day. This is all kind of crazy. Please forgive me if I mess up. I'm still learning how to do this, but I am curious how you thought day one in history went. That's going to be our do now for the day. I'm going to ask you to rate how you thought day one went what went well, what didn't go so well. But uh, before we get to that, I have a couple of quick announcements. We had a couple of problems on Tuesday with the comments. I want to keep the comments open uh, so you guys can stay in touch with me during class. It's a lot faster than an email. Like if I forget to post something or if you can't open something, you can let me know right away. I think it's a pretty useful tool. But on Tuesday, we had some problems with people swearing in the comments. We had a lot of people bullying each other in the comments, and at AFF, we don't allow that. The comments will be shut down if we can't live up to the expectations of AFF. That means no swearing. That means no insulting other people. Um, I'm going to keep the comments open for now, but if you're using foul language or if you're insulting classmates, there's going to be consequences. Number one, the first consequence, your comment's going to be deleted, and it's going to be forwarded to Mr. Hartford and Miss Antonson. Number two, if it happens again, we're going to be contacting your parents, and you're going to be muted in my classroom. I know you just want to type something funny to your friend, but we are in school, and we have to act like scholars. So just remember that everything that you say online is always being saved for your parents or for Mr. Hartford to see. That being said, I do like having the comments open so that you can stay in touch with me about the assignment and sometimes we could even talk about fun things like video games or whatever. As long as it's not hurting other people's feelings, I think we can have fun with this distance learning stuff without being hateful or hurtful. Look, there's people out there who are actually dying of this virus, so let's try to treat each other with a little bit of compassion, please. Um, go ahead right now. And click on the next slide to get started with our do now. I will see you over there.